All right, ladies and gentlemen and the YouTube citizens, y'all know who this is. This is your boy True Inferno, and Happy New Year. Today's day is January the 1st, so it's the first of the year. Yes. So I'm doing another indoor video, and here's why. If you recall in my last video, I gave you guys my 10, 10, 10, shout out to Ty Denitrix, my 10 predictions for Pokemon Go in the year 2018. Now what I'm about to do is give you guys my five goals for this year involving Pokemon Go. So obviously these are the things I want to accomplish involving the game. Now from five on up, from the bottom on up rather, we talking about the most difficult to the least difficult. So with all that said, let's get straight into number five. Number five, as I need to drop my phone, number five will be really tough, I will admit. And I'm gonna try to accomplish this this year. I got 364 days. Is it a leap year? I don't know. But I got 364 plus days at least or whatever to accomplish this. And that is it. I want to hang with a Pokemon Go YouTuber. But here's the catch. Uh, I want to hang with a Pokemon Go YouTuber that does not reside in Michigan. So, Hybrid Mongoose, Scoop Fist, and Fog Bark, and whoever else that's in Michigan that is a Pokemon Go YouTuber, you do not count. I apologize because that's easy. Like, I can easily pull that off, you know. So, I done it with Hybrid Mongoose. I met uh, Fog Bark. You know, me and Scoop Fist, we were actually talking about collaborating at one point. But, you know, that didn't fall through. Mostly because he was like too far away or whatever. But either way, that could easily be accomplished. No, I'm talking about leaving the state of Michigan and going to hang out with a Pokemon Go YouTuber or one of them coming to my neck of the woods and I hang out with them. So that's why I say it is the most difficult on the list, but I'm gonna try to get that done. Number four. Now I mentioned number four in my last video and you probably should know what I'm talking about. In case you don't, obviously I'm going to give you my number 4 goal for Pokemon Go in 2018. And that is this. Your boy will go back to Go. So I talked about in my last video, spoiler alert, if you didn't watch it, I'm going to give you pause right here. Go watch that video. Again, my 10 predictions for Pokemon Go in 2018. Then come back to this point in the video. I talked about one of my predictions is that GoFest will be back in Chicago this year. And obviously if it is, I'm definitely going, whether I get a ticket or not, because of really the after party. Fun, fun. It, it was dope. It was dope last year, even though I, I left immediately after Go Fest, unfortunately. I don't want to miss out on that. So yeah, I'm gonna try to go to Go Fest this year. And the reason why it's number four instead of higher on the list, especially because I went to Go Fest last year, because we don't know how they're gonna do the tickets. Last year they just said, hey, we selling tickets, go on this website, buy them. I tried to buy the tickets on the website, I couldn't get them. Luckily, somebody in the Discord group has extra tickets, and I was able to buy one off for her. Thank you very much for that. This year, I don't know how they're gonna get, you know, give out these tickets. So hopefully, you know, they change that up, and hopefully everybody have a fair shot of getting the ticket. And another reason why I love the list is because another thing that I explored in my last video regarding the location of Go Fest is it could be in New York. I mean, I'm just throwing it out there. There's no source to back that up. I'm just throwing it out there because out of all the major cities in the United States, there was not a Pokemon Go event in New York. And, you know, with the trailer, it's kind of hinted that something might went down or go down in New York, but yet nothing happened yet. So they could move Go Fest to New York. Either way, I still want to go because I always want to go to New York as well. So number four, your boy will be going to Go Fest. Now, number three, ironically enough, ties in to some degree with my number five goal and my number four goal. And that is this. I want to play Pokemon Go in another state. But here's the disclaimer today. It cannot be Go Fest, and it cannot be in the same state where the Pokemon Go YouTuber resides. So we're talking about me doing a lot of traveling this year. Now, let me give you some possible goals as far as traveling is concerned. Last year, last year's summer, we were talking about going, to, we as in the family, we were talking about going to the Bahamas. Obviously, there's no Pokemon Go YouTuber residing in the Bahamas, as far as I know. And my boy, he wanted to go to Vegas. Originally, that was supposed to be in April, but he moved it back to August. And I told him, hey, I've never been to Vegas. I want to roll too. 
So, we'll see how that goes. And as I recall, I don't recall from my go YouTube of being in there either. So that's why this is higher than me going back to GoFest because the ticket scenario and the location of GoFest are unknown. But I'm going somewhere this year, whether it's to the Bahamas, to Vegas, possibly both. So, whichever one of those two spots I go to, I will be playing Pokemon Go, and that's my number three goal for 2018. Number two. Number two. I think some of you may have suggested this or thought this in your mind. And it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Before I accomplish number three, I want to accomplish number two first. And this, compared to number three, four, and five, this one's easy. And that is to get a new camera. So the scenario with this camera is this is the Sony A5000. And the original lens that came with it broke. So I had to use, you know, I bought three different lenses. And none of them have autofocus and things that will let you know autofocus or auto, you know, lens or whatever. So it's kind of hard for me to shoot natural videos. But I want a new camera because, you know, to upgrade the quality up to 4K. So I'm gonna gun for the A6300. You're probably thinking, why not go for the 7000 series or wait for the 9000 or whatever? That is a lot of money. That's really it. So. The six, even though the 6300 is a lot of money as well, but it's more reasonable and it gets the job done in terms of video. Like I did some research on these cameras and outside of the 9000, which is again like way out there in terms of price. But based on what I saw, the 6300 is the best one for YouTube video. So that's my number two goal is to get a new camera. My number one goal for this year in Bar Pokemon Go, I actually talked about this a bit in my last video. So, again, go and watch that in case you didn't watch this one. Actually, you should have done that already after I mentioned my number, what was it, my number four goal? Yeah, my number four goal. So, here's the goal, here's the scenario. My number one goal that I want to accomplish, that I think I will accomplish in 2018. Reach level 40. So, yes, I think I will reach level 40. I am this close. From reaching level 39, and once I reach level 39, the countdown will be on in order, you know, as far as me going to level 40. And I mentioned in my last video that they will increase the cap this year. That's my prediction. So I'm hoping that they do that later on in the year, <laughs> you know, so I can reach level 40 and max out my character and just relax and chill for a bit to some degree. And then they can raise the cap, and then I can grind to reach that cap again so yeah my number one goal for 2018 reach level 40 so yeah that was my five goals for Pokemon Go in 2018 what are your goals that you want to accomplish involving this game for this year let me know in the comment section below so with all that said man y'all know who this is this is your boy the new Jake Asby aka the new Stephen A. Smith saying peace out y'all and I'll see y'all next time have a happy and safe new year take care